Welcome to another tutorial on this channel. Today's gonna be a brief one. I just want to show you how to do permanent redirects and also quickly explain why you would want to do that. So the example here, I have a homepage and on this homepage I have this tutorial page and up here you see the address. It's called editing Milky Way photos html so this is already the revised url i'm using and i did some optimization here because before it was called start to finish minus desert minus nights and in terms of seo this is not a good name for that page so watch what happens now if i give this old url and press enter it will automatically switch it to the new url so i will now show you how you can set this up inside of HD access files on your server and quickly explain why I did this. So one very important part of SEO optimization is optimizing the content of your pages and with it also making sure that you optimize for certain keywords. And this includes also providing proper URLs. So it's not enough to just have a proper H1 tag here, proper description, proper title. To really optimize it, you should also make sure that the URL is optimized for your keywords, which is what I did here. So I basically changed the name of the URL. So the problem with that, if I change a URL, there might already be links for the old URL. So some other pages might link to that URL, which I inserted before this start to finish desert nights and if i just rename the url push it to my server all those links will no longer be found that's not good and here's where redirecting comes in and i quickly show you how to do it so typically in the root of your home page you have an htaccess file it's called .htaccess and if you don't have one yet you can just create a new empty one this file can be used to configure how the server does certain things like for example down here I tell it to compress certain files and I tell it where the error pages are. For example if a user requests a page which does not exist what it should do. I have some HTTP to HTTPS redirecting here and down here in this last one this lines 49 to 51 is where I do permanent redirects for specific pages. And yeah, let me just quickly show you how this command works. First thing is you check if this module modles.c is available on the server because the redirect directive is part of that module. And that's quite typical if you look up here, there are other modules, for example, this mod deflate. And it's typical that you place the commands which belong to a model inside such a check here where you check is this module available on your server just to make sure that it properly works. Also up here there's another module which is called mod rewrite. But for the simple redirects we want to do we just need the mod underscore alias.c. So you check this and then you also always close up this block here. And inside this block you already see here I have a redirect directive. And this is very simple you just say redirect then you say permanent. You could also say 301, which is basically the same. So a 301 redirect is a permanent redirect. And that's the important ones if you want to do such SEO optimizations like I did, where you rename a page. So you want a permanent redirect from the old page. So this is the next parameter. You provide the relative URL, so relative to your domain. Let's have a quick look, basically starting after your domain here with the first slash tutorials and then the old URL which was start to finish minus desert nights HTML and then you tell it where it should redirect this page to and here you use the complete URL including the HTTPS slash then your domain and then the path of the new page and that's really all there is and what you can do if you do this for more pages you can add more redirect routines here and what you can also do is if you have a folder with many pages and you change the folder name you could also use regex there's a redirect match routine which i'm not going to cover in this tutorial because i wanted to keep this one simple so here we just use the simple redirect command to redirect one page to another page you can use multiple of those redirect commands and then yeah once you're finished you just have to make sure to push this new htaccess file 
onto your server into the root of your home page and then when you test it it should already work your server should pick it up and yeah you have successfully redirected an old page to a new one and that being said we're now at the end of the tutorial i hope you liked it if so make sure to leave a thumbs up also subscribe for more videos and yeah see you in the next video bye